All right, what's going on, everyone? Thanks for tuning in. It's Bit Sandwich here, and we have a special guest today with some incredible, incredible ideas, as well as uh, physical things that are coming to this realm. Would love to show you and share with you. Please introduce yourself today. Hello, how you doing? I'm Drew Holiday, everybody. I'm from Drew's Drama Network, LLC. It's my pleasure to join this video meeting today and uh, I'll tell you a little something about myself. I'm the founder and inventor of Integrated Gaming Feature Card. And I want to start this off by um, saying I've been looking for four months for a partner and through Indeed, I found Bit Savage, Mark, who's my partner. So diligently, my search took a while, but um, I found him through Indeed. I found him through Indeed, and also uh, was, was brought to my attention on his resume that he was in the West Hollywood Lifestyles from 2016, where they did an article on his work and attributes to the technology sector and billboard advertisement in uh, Hollywood, uh, West Hollywood. Yes, indeed. During the day, yes. During the day, um, I work at a hospital, feed and sip children. I've been doing this for 25 years. I love my job, and um, I feed them to health according to their diets. And at night, what I do is I mess with projects and ideals and uh, I started this in 2006, not this project right here, but that's when I entered the uh, realm of things and introduced myself to Wall Street mm -hmm. and uh, I didn't look back. I would like the time right now to let my partner introduce himself. So you want to take it from there? Yeah, definitely, definitely. So uh, I've been, you know, from the East Coast, been been in LA for five, six years now, and I've just been on this path of discovery and, you know, being very creative, super creative, and because of the, the popularity of blockchain, you know, coming to the, you know, the technical sector and getting into more of the software, a little bit of hardware of things. So I'm in a position to where now, I'm all about the digital, the digital verse, the digital era, you know, creating yeah things to just connect people you know we had the internet come out and it connected people globally like never before and we're just starting to see like the we're at the beginning of augmented reality virtual reality and that next level yes um so 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 tell us if you can how much can you share with how integrated uh gaming feature came into existence what what happened? <laughs> yeah, well, um, here we go. Um, it all orig originated last summer. So the thought behind the process was what's going to happen when all this automation comes in and uh, uh, AI? So I took a list of things and put them together and this is what I came up with. Let me get my notes here to help me out a little bit. You have the harvest automation that's going on in agriculture. Yeah. You have the, uh, the digital kiosks in the restaurants. Yeah. yeah. You have the um, autonomous cars and trucks. They're here. The industry alone with the truck drivers will eliminate 50 million jobs in America alone. Wow. When it's implemented. Wow. And then you also have the janitorial uh, 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 with schools and department stores where they're stripping floors, waxing, and you have large chains moving in this direction that's being done overnight. So all this is um, eliminating jobs. So my question was, what's going to happen to all the people that once held these jobs? That's true. <laughs> So uh, here we go. <laughs> I came up with two concepts. And under the concepts, what it is I'm trying to achieve is globally to have the planet under one entity. My first one that I submitted in August of last year was called TF Mess. 
which is transformational format, monetization by entities on social platforms. Now, I did this myself under Facebook last year as a, as a test, and it worked. The end result didn't come to being monetized, but the way I set it up on the platforms, it worked. Okay. But the byproduct of that came into being, which is the um, integrated game and feature card. Nice. Nice. The integrated feature card, and by the way, both of these are patent pending. So um, by doing this, it was the byproduct of that. Now everything becomes monetized. So the question is, wouldn't everybody on these platforms love to own their own entity? Yes, they and would. Yes, yes. Let's everybody become a business. And the way my philosophy runs with this is that everybody and anybody can set this up. And later on, I'll elaborate more on that. By doing also the integrated game and feature card, what I did was I took the feature card and it needs to be integrated to a circuit board on a game console. Okay. A VR headset. Yes. So, now, everybody pretty much plays game. Well, <laughs> what this is going to do is through online gaming and the gambling industry, once again, them two sectors, it should bring them both together as one. What it is is that you take the online gamers on the console and their VR headsets through virtual reality. Every time you play the game, now it's monetized. I so you have to be 18 years or older to be able to use this product. But instead of just sitting and playing your games, now every experience is monetized. I so know. instead of having the tournaments where just a few of the best uh, gets to participate, now everybody is a global participant. So under the application, of the patent pending uh, 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 confirmation, I chose to endorse the Cash App. Why the Cash App? For various reasons. Because through the platform of Twitter, which is also owned by Cash App and Square, they use the blockchain technology. I'm not aware if everybody knows this. Mr. Dorsey runs all three platforms. Nice. Of, of, of that. So, they used the blockchain, they implemented it now. With doing so, this becomes helpful in the global application of what it is I'm trying to do of bringing everything to one under one entity. Now, you're able, it's valid to use this in America, Japan, Australia, Canada, and the UK. Mm. I've been doing my research. The most top five countries in GDP, I just named three of them, that's allowed in the Cash App application. Nice, nice. The UK, America, and Japan. And also the Bank of Jam uh, Japan just did something. They're the largest bank on the planet. They just did something uh, 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 with the cryptocurrency endorsing it. Nice. I'm getting more information on it. It just happened last week. So now everything becomes global. So the question I ask is who would want to turn what they do into an own entity on their own social platforms? Make it's it. the question I ask. That's true. Wow. Wow. With all these platforms, when I was on Facebook, there was, um, I had 3,000 users. And I'm going through my users, and they're having 3,000, 4,000, 5,000. And I'm like, well, what are they doing with these followers? Yeah. Yep, you can monetize yeah. it. Right, exactly. So the light bulb went off, and I did it last year. Now, everybody could be the own host of their own entity. There you go. Once That's it. Play all that later, yeah. But this is going to be global. Because the end product of what I'm trying to do is not only get it 
on game consoles and um, the VR headsets, which is different all by itself because that industry has to catch up to what I'm doing because virtual reality doesn't make it competitive yet. Well, actually, let me correct myself. They just started they, yeah. making it competitive. They just started that. Start, yeah. uh, yes. So this is already ahead of this time, what I'm doing. But it will allow one entity at the end of it under the model, uh, everybody monetizing. Nice. So that's what I'm trying to do. And um, I thank you for joining the corporation and doing the, um, the research part and helping with technical support. With them, you've been with the corporation and you joined me in uh, the middle of March and uh, you already set up some meetings and everything. And uh, I just went to one on the 12th of this month in Philadelphia. Yeah. Not only were they impressed, I amazed them. <laughs> I never had the opportunity to elaborate from beginning to end what it is that I'm doing. And at the network, it is my philosophy and job not only to satisfy the end user, but to amaze them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. So that's what it is that we're trying to do. Nice. And um, you still have my vision? Yes, yeah, still can see you. And so, yeah, so this is, this is very, uh, very enlightening because I think everyone can kind of feel, they can feel the, the automation coming in. They can feel the yeah. kids coming in. They can feel the, uh, you got YouTube, Google with their algorithms. It's all coming in and everyone can feel it and, you know, be aware of it. Exactly. Which is incredible. Uh, I just wanted to ask really quick with, I know people are just, they see, you know, you had the card, you had the slider. Just uh, explain it a little further without, you know, spilling all the beans. So is this card reader, is it uh, able to go on any console, any headset, just integrate right into the motherboard? Yes, the, um, the card itself will adapt to any any card available. It's just that I suggest uh, cards that's under the blockchain because also we bring crypto into this. Gotcha. Because yes, when I say yes, <laughs> when I say games, I'm talking games of all aspects, and crypto is doing something uh, in that space, and it's catching on like wildfire. So um, that's why I recommend the Cash App because of the blockchain and the usage globally. But any card will be able to use this application with the um, console and the VR headsets. Okay, I see. So it's, it's, uh, it's almost like a universal card reader. And yes. you got, you, you're definitely, it's incredible to have a payment system or a system that's on the blockchain. And it's uh, it can be verified, decentralized, or whatever whatever you want it to do on the blockchain, you can do it. There's many chains out there. Correct. And just touching on cryptocurrency a little bit, uh, I work with one company called Engine that's based on the Ethereum uh, blockchain, and they're really they're huge into digital assets. So now it can become uh, a situation to where you have these games around the world, players they own their characters, they own parts, they have different types of currencies and now it's it's literally a 24 7 global market yes. where anyone can monetize anyone can create an opportunity have fun yes. and and it's just we're, we're literally we're in a different time right now it's just it's all happening right now right right all happening in the present and that's what I'm elaborating on because is going in that direction anyway by no choice, like I stated, once all the um, the robots and automation comes in. Nice. So, I mean, it, it makes sense. It makes right. sense. So, I know there's some cool things coming up. What uh, what should people be doing right now? What can they do? Can they, can they, can they invest, donate, get what, can they find out more? What, what should the people do? Okay, I'm glad you asked. Um, we're, we're, uh, we're doing some things moving in that direction. Next month, I'll go for me and be set up. And um, 
going back to the investor I met in Philadelphia on the 12th of this month, they gave us the criteria for what needs to be done okay. as far as getting their investments. Okay. So we have to meet their criteria with some other uh, applications. And then at the end of that, it'll be a, um, investors brought in. And then we have to give a pitch. And then they'll match the dollar up to a quarter million. So uh, we, we have some work to do here at the network. And uh, they wanted me to uh, keep in touch with how we're going, how we're moving. So um, we'll be looking at the network to do a uh, GoFundMe sometime next month in May. Nice. So um, also, we're going to be doing more marketing and um, videos through the um, Vimeo application. So uh, nice. that's something I just signed on up to uh, as far as the app myself. So I like that platform. And then that's where you can find what we're doing at real time on there. I asked my partner to set up a couple surveys, such as ask everybody, is this something you would want to do for yourself on your own business? Basically, sit at home and make money. <laughs> as simple as that. I mean, it don't take no rocket scientist. You just sit at home and make money. You already got people on your platforms. All you got to do is monetize it and become the host. So I'll be elaborating on this under that new app of the videos with uh, Vimeo. Nice. Uh, explain step by step how to do it because I already tried it out last year on Facebook and it worked. It worked. So um, it's already a proven fact. Mix in with the integrated game and feature card that's out there also. So nice. these two independent ideals is uh, moving in the right direction. And also, we're just trying to uh, link up with an actual uh, console maker and a VR headset maker to have this configured and integrated to their motherboard. Nice, nice. Yeah, I um, I definitely champion uh, disruption in a, for the better good. And what I mean yeah. by this is, uh, you know, if you if you think about the workforce, you know, you have businesses, corporations, your nine to five jobs. I, I see a positive disruption in this whole entire workforce to where individuals now have a choice. They say, oh, I, I could either apply for this job or I could try this, try to be my own boss yes. as well as pursue my passions. So yes. we, we have multiple streams of income and multiple choices of success. Then now you can have a little bit more control over your life. You, you'll feel like, okay, I can do something a little different than just the normal status quo from the past. Exactly. So I'm excited. Uh, we'll get those surveys out to everyone. Thanks for tuning in. And any questions, any comments, any critiques, definitely send us send it our way. Uh, I'm I'm definitely behind the scenes doing various things with uh, just research, digital assets, as well as global gaming. And you know, Drew Holiday, you're bringing some incredible stuff to the world. And I I definitely champion anyone that's building. That's, that's thinking ideas, seeing them through, and just, uh, you know, allowing co community res resources to come towards you. Also, I want to give them a few uh, contact info. Um, you can find me on ProtonMail under uh, Network LLC at ProtonMail.com. And also, you can find me on Twitter under Drew Holiday. So, uh, nice. Come on through and check out the amazing work that we're doing. And also my website is at um, drewdrama.network as well. So uh, those are some links that you can follow up on. And also um, I'll be doing things under the new application app that I just got, uh, the Vimeo. So uh, get that app. And uh, remember, get your cash app. It's coming. Get your cash app. <laughs> Yeah, I was. Thank you for your time, Bit Savage, and your interview. Back at you. Yeah. Okay.
I want to uh, really quick touch on how surprising that I, I was using Square for a while now. I've been using Square and uh, Venmo. And then I saw like, the Cash App come out. Then I saw you can get Bitcoin with it. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe PayPal will, will allow Bitcoin purchases. We'll exactly. See. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Well, I didn't put down for this. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. Cool, man. So, yeah, thank you for sharing what you have, all your ideas, your patent pending, you know, the things that are coming to this world. Yes. And, you know, I'm, I'm definitely here to support and create and really see it through to the end. Um, yes. We're in a good time. This is the time to, to build. This is, <laughs> this is yes. the time. <laughs> and also, uh, remember, when we launch um, the GoFundMe next month, we can use everybody's support. Dollar for dollar, we appreciate it. No matter what, how small, it doesn't matter to us. We're very humble at what we do, and we appreciate everything and anything. Cool. Yeah, we need your support. Let's make this dream a reality. If you yes. uh, want to, if you want to learn more, I'll definitely leave the information below. We have the website. Thanks again for coming on the show. We've got cool, great things coming. Thank you. Bye. All right now. Okay. Money to people.